Right. <clears throat> Here's the project I have going on. I had a 6.5 horsepower craft, Craftsman lawnmower. Sorry, I can't speak. It's kind of late. I'm tired. And uh, I went ahead and took out the uh, intake manifold that came with it. Because the one blew a rod, and I'm not even going to fix that. And I got me this nice little go kart for 60 bucks. And the guy sold it really cheap because he has this 5 horsepower Briggs that he didn't know how to get it to uh, stay on. I mean, you can compare it to my bike back there. It's a little big. And uh, so what I tried to do, I cleaned the carburetor, which is right here, the one that it came with. And the tank was super rusted, but I was having issues trying to get this thing to work because it kept getting clogged up from the rust. And I had to rig that diaphragm part right there just to keep it on there because whoever had it before destroyed the threads on that. So back to the uh, go-kart, the intake from the Craftsman is right here, and I was able to hook it up to the block and hooked up this tech, tech and say carburetor. And what I did was I grabbed the Craftsman's gas tank, I bought a fuel filter, and I hooked it up over here from where the extra fumes comes out. I hooked it up to this little line up here. And I was having issues getting this thing to start with. But now I, I got a new uh, O-ring for the carburetor after I cleaned it. And now it starts right up. So I'm going to go ahead and give it a shot and y'all see what you think. Got it to work somehow, but let me know, see what you guys think. Any questions about this uh, Frankenstein rig for this flathead rig? It's my first gig I have for a Briggs flathead. So any comments, any concerns that I need to know, you guys let me know. All right, out.